back. Canada was never my friend. Disgusted with him right now. Completely disgusted. A lot of people were high on Matt Canada, not only inside the Steelers community, but outside. And I'm pretty sure I had led that charge along with, you know, some other people. But I had made so many Matt Canada videos to the point where it was clearly me, the one fully promoting it. And if it failed, then that was a huge drop. And well, it did. So I'm going to take self-responsibility for that. And I'm going to just say this. I'm sorry to anybody who I gave false hope to. And quite frankly... I had the same false hope, but to be fair, I did back up everything I said with a ton of evidence and film, so at least it was entertaining. But with that being said, all the expectations went out the window by about week six or seven because at that point, we all knew it was just Randy Feekner's offense with a couple different motions here and there. The route concepts were terrible. We would go empty set when we had a terrible O-line and terrible route combinations. That's not a good combination, no matter which quarterback you have. You could have Deshaun Watson, for God's sakes, and it's still not going to work out 99.9% .9 of the time. And quite frankly, it's time to start new when it comes to this offense. New old line, new offensive coordinator, new quarterback. You get the point. We just need a fresh start. We've been trying to force it these past three years, trying to make a deep playoff run when it clearly isn't there. If we could really just go through one good transition, year where we rebuild fill our holes get a good foundation for our future quarterback good foundation as in good o-line that would be great because quite frankly matt canada was just a pawn in this little game we got to look at it this way the patriots had to go through a rebuild transition year for only one year once tom brady left and big ben basically left when his elbow got injured because he wasn't going to be the same guy who could carry this team without an o-line so while matt canada was a disappointment there's a lot of other different things that goes into it my only hope going into the future though is to get an offensive coordinator who's experienced who has a resume in the nfl of building and establishing a run game with at least decent route combinations if we could just get that i would be happy because i don't have too many expectations for the steelers offense at this point but i hope you guys enjoyed this video and that's it for me on this one Peace. Tell me what you guys think about Canada in the comment section below.